Ranger team with a three just gave me access to the SnowRunner RNG NPV mod truck. Here is a look at it in action, plus some other cool mods. The people at the Ranger mod team very kindly let me have access to another SnowRunner truck. The first being the RNG TX Armored Beasts and the TX Bridge Layer for bridging gaps that many of you have been messing around with. This time it is the RNG MPV, OMG. MPV is of course short for multi-purpose vehicle. The plan is to show you four minutes of it in action because I'm only allowed to show four minutes and no bugs either. Start the clock. Currently in alpha and unavailable to the public, one should assume some issues with the RNG MPV. Alpha is an early stage of development and so it would be unfair to judge too harshly. In any case, my first impressions have been positive. The model itself goes nicely with the TX's military rugged arms like Vin Diesel vibe. Chunky tires, searchlights, cargo storage, it looks cool. Sadly, there is no giant machine gun on the back, but then this is SnowRunner, not Battlefield, or Crossout, or Halo. You may notice I am not using the raised suspension. That is because it does not work yet, nor is there much in the way of customization and add-ons, which limits the NPV's multi-purposefulness. Still, this is early days. I would imagine more stuff will be added later to help it live up to its name. I should probably talk about how it drives. Kind of important, right? The RNG MPV is pretty potent, even with the weakest engine. Yeah, it is struggling with some of this mod map's rockier areas and steeper slopes, but that seems realistic to me. It feels natural to drive and the suspension soaks up bumps nicely, but without being spongy. Ground clearance and tyre size are generous. I would say it rides like you would expect a large amount of military metal to, for better and for worse. Next up, we have another Ranger mod. This time it is Awesome's Trailer Pack, which apparently is on console and PC, unlike the MPV, which is currently PC only. The mod description says this is, and I quote, the start of a trailer pack. So there will be more than the two initial trailers in future. The first is a four slot offering with some fine 3D modeling and detail going on, connects to a normal trailer hitch and does the job nicely. The second is a four slot semi-trailer for trucks with a low saddle add-on. Similar design ethos, but this time you get trailer legs you can deploy manually. For variety, the trailers are worth a look, and at under 5,000 SnowRunner coins, neither is costly. What exactly is next for the awesome trailer pack? According to its Ranger Group makers, more trailers of different sizes, and some logging luggers too. Log luggers lugging logs with a log lugging logging lugger. Can you do better? While many of us are still bitter about the whole log carrier add-on being limited to small logs only, which currently only exist in a more, unless it is the Caterpillar 745C, more log trailer options are welcome. And lastly, while I am here, I will look at the already popular RNG Mercedes-Benz Zetros, Zetros, whatever you prefer. This particular version is for PC, but there is a more recent console-friendly alternative, so nobody has to miss out. Based on the real Mercedes truck of the same name, the Zetros Zetros first arrived in 2008, and has since been used to do just about everything, much like the Unimog, even tractoring, actually. 
It started out with a 7.2 litre diesel, but it was later equipped with a 12 litre variant. In SnowRunner, it is also suitably versatile. There is a radar add-on for doing what watchtowers do, plus cranes, custom cargo beds, various tyres, and a whole lot more to keep you and the Z monster busy. This model looks excellent, and unlike many mods, the PC version is official. Daimler gave written permission to use its logo and branding apparently, which is nice. I think more companies should do that. Is it worth using? Hell yes, although this is a powerful truck. If you like to play snow in a vanilla style, you will not like this mod. If, however, you just want to blitz along in all terrain types, then you have come to the right place. To be honest, I quite like using a mixture of mod and normal trucks, and this is one of the best examples of the former. As with most Ranger offerings, with a three, the quality is top notch, and you can drive something a little different. And that is it for this SnowRunner Mod Truck video. Hopefully you enjoyed my three Ranger with a three selection as usual. If you enjoy a mod or have any feedback, let the makers know directly. Or let me know what you think in the comments. Until the next video on A Tribe Called Cars, look after yourself, take care, bye.